Bean's adventure to the El Paso Museum of Art. As I walked in into the El Paso Museum of Art, I saw all of these wonderful sculptures. And to my left, I saw a piece of artwork that was done by Gaspar Enriquez. It's titled, Tirando Royal, I Love You. The material that was used was acrylic on paper. To prove that I went to the El Paso Museum of Art, I took a selfie in front of the piece that I chose. As you can see behind me, each piece is covered with glass, so the glare from the light would be seen in each picture. For a better visual, I decided to use a picture from the internet, so that way the visual can be seen better and my visual analysis will have an overall better view. Now, on the right is a picture of the artist, Gaspar Enriquez. Now that you have seen the piece and the artist, let's begin with the visual analysis. Starting with the line qualities, there are mostly soft lines, which are multiple strokes that can be seen in the hair. Those soft lines are also curved lines. Other curved lines include the chin, the ear, and the eyes, and the eyebrows. There is also shading and modeling that can be seen in the face and the neck that convey three-dimensionality. This part of the piece includes the letter I, which is done in cursive writing. It is a yellow tint. This piece also shows visual textures. Because of the eye, it looks like it is done in spray paint. Because it is a visual texture, it's just a surface quality, which is the spray paint, which implies that it is an implied texture. This part of the piece includes examples of chiaroscuro in the pants. Chiaroscuro can be seen in the many folds of the pants. As the definition says, chiaroscuro is the gradation shifting of light and dark through the gradations of neutrals to create volume and mass in a subtle way. This part shows many different values that create shadows, which show three-dimensionality in the face of the girl. This piece shows a heart, which is a geometric shape because it has both curved and straight lines. The heart is done in a tint of red. It also shows a technique of space, which is overlapping. The heart is overlapping the girl's body which it partially covers. As you can see, there are also other geometric shapes in the midsection line of the girl's shirt. This part shows the girl's pants again. As I said earlier, it is also a form of chiaroscuro. If you haven't noticed yet, I only did a visual analysis of two of the three sections of the piece. This is because the elements repeat throughout the, each piece. Overall, this piece is a natural, naturalistic style because it shows the techniques which are needed for it to qualify as naturalistic. Those techniques include chiaroscuro, visual textures, and space is coherent just like we see in real life, as well as scale and proportion in the whole girl's body. Each piece can be considered a monochromatic piece, but altogether it cannot because it includes two tints and neutrals. This piece can also be considered a two-dimensional medium, but more specifically, painting. Lastly, I would like to say thank you for watching my visual analysis of the piece by Gaspar Enriquez de Royal. I love you.